Now, here's meteorologist T.J. Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, we are looking at dry skies right now. Some clouds still hanging around. Temperatures today were a little on the cool side. We topped out at 50 degrees, but if you were in that uh, relatively strong April sun and it felt pretty good, live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar, nice and dry, but it's no secret that it's been a little on the soggy side for the past week or so. In fact, we broke a rainfall record. This was the wettest first week of April on record. Took a long time to kind of figure this stuff out, but yeah, 3.84 inches of rain fell over the past seven days. It uh, was wetter than 1973 when 3.59 inches fell. And interestingly enough, 2016, 3.31 inches of rain fell during the first week of April, but that was really about it for uh, rainfall last April. The rest of the month was pretty dry. Threat tracker for tonight, low chance of anything severe. Same for Sunday, same for Monday, just severely nice weather on the way for the next few days. Hurricane barrier cam, we're looking west, nice and dry. We've got a few clouds uh, hanging around still. Down in Newport, nice and dry, quiet night. Temperatures are in the mid 40s in the city by the sea. New Bedford 43, Taunton 42, Providence 46, westerly at 46 degrees. Live weather info from Coventry 45. They've got a wind about three miles an hour. Warwick 45 degrees, wind from the southwest to six. Satellite radar picture, actually I have some sprinkles out there across northeastern mass maybe to the outer cape but it's nice and dry here in southeastern new england we're stuck between an area of low pressure to our north and east area of high pressure to our south and west and in between we've got kind of a, a little bit of a wind machine it was a little on the breezy side today this area of high pressure here is going to take control of our weather giving us uh, dry skies but also some warmer weather let's see how it all plays out. Future cast for Sunday morning sunshine taking you into the afternoon. We hold on to the sun right through the early evening. Maybe a few clouds around tomorrow night, but that's about it. Sunshine for Monday morning, sunshine for Monday afternoon looking just fine. Let's track the temperatures. Temperatures tomorrow afternoon will be topping out in the low 60s for Monday morning. 53 good launching pad for temperatures to soar up around 70 degrees Monday afternoon. It might actually be a little bit warmer than that on Tuesday. So we're looking good for the next few days and we'll also have some dry weather. Forecast for Sunday morning starting out a little on the cool side and in the 30s, but lots of sun getting into the mid 50s by noontime. Let's pinpoint the afternoon right along the coastline. Be a little bit cooler. Low to mid 50s here. 63 degrees in Wickford, 51 in Newport, Northern Rhode Island, about 62 Johnston, low to mid 60s in Providence, West Warwick and Warwick and Cranston, about 63. Fall River to New Bedford, lower 60s should do a beautiful weather everywhere. Live in point upper 12, seven day future cast. So Monday we're starting out in the uh, 40s, getting up into the upper 60s in the afternoon. Looks great. Tuesday, we could be uh, finding temperatures in the 70s inland, probably about 70 in Providence along the immediate coast. It's the time of year. It's always cooler there in the 50s. The record high for Providence on Tuesday is 79 degrees. Probably won't hit that, but we'll watch it. Wednesday, some showers around, maybe some more showers late Thursday night, very early on Friday morning. So we're not looking at a wet week, but we're looking at a pretty warm week, especially the first half. A record wet week week for April. First of April, April 1st to 7th. Okay. I'm not surprised. Wettest first week yeah. of April on record. No, no surprise at yeah. all. Yeah, I just texted my wife. Can't wait. She'll probably say no kidding. <laughs> <All> right, <laughs> thanks, TJ. Yeah. Coming up in sports on Eyewitness News at 10. The